Hi everybody, Tina here with Two Chicks and a Cricket, and this is another Valentine's Day card for our Valentine's Day card series, and this is going to be a really simple uh, card. You're not, it's not going to be complicated at all, I promise. It's just going to be the most simple card you've ever seen. So if you have a lot of these to do, this would be a good card to do for that. So we're going to be using a couple stamp sets. I'm going to be using... Uh, my Pink Stamper, some of her stamps, and then some Stampin' Up stamps, and then some Stampin' Up products. This pattern paper is Stampin' Up paper. It was in the Mini um, Occasions catalog last year, and as of um, the beginning of the year, it, this paper was in the clearance rack for like four dollars or something. I'm not sure if it's still there or not, but you could check and this paper was super cute I got it last year so check Stampin' Up's clearance rack to see if it's still there if you're interested in this paper and it's double sided paper super cute we're using cherry cobbler and basic gray and very vanilla Stampin' Up paper colors so let's get started with this simple card I just have a piece of cherry cobbler red cardstock and I'm gonna um, I just cut it in half I cut the eight and a half by eleven piece of paper in half and then I'm just folding it the next thing that I've done is I've taken um, a lot of this paper stuff I've already done for you guys just so that it's less time consuming on camera so I've already cut down my mats and this is just one large mat and I just eyeballed it like I usually do I it's four my cards four and a quarter by five and a half so it just took like about a quarter inch off the side so it's like four by five and a quarter Before I glue that down, I just realized, I just want to take my ink dauber and I'm just going to ink around the edges in cherry cobbler. Next, I have a piece of basic gray, and honestly, this piece was in my scraps already, and it's two and a quarter by three and a quarter, or two and a half by three and a half, somewhere right around in there. Um, they were, both my mats were different because I did two of these. So I just pulled that out because it fit perfect. So what I wanted was just something right in the center of my card. And this is just going to get glued down. Next I have a piece of Very Vanilla. And it fits right. Again, I just took a quarter inch off each side. It fits right in the middle of that basic gray. And I'm going to take my Cherry Cobbler again and ink the edges. And when you're inking the edges of your stuff, you can either give it a very light inking or you can be a little bit heavier with the ink. It just depends on what you prefer. I personally love inking. I ink just about everything. Alright, so that's going to be it for the cherry cobbler and I'm gonna do my stamping first before I glue it down it's just a good idea to do that just in case you mess up you can always flip your paper over or grab another piece if you glue it down it makes it a little bit more difficult so for Stampin' Up! we're using this is uh, the greeting card kids and this is a super cute stamp set and I'm gonna be using this little girl 
uh, for this card and she's really she's real sweet and uh, this is a it's not a wood mount it's a clear mount I'm just gonna pop her on my clear block and I'm using basic gray uh, basic black to stamp her oops well we're having a little bit of a problem getting her to stick okay so we're just using basic black to stamp and I'm gonna stamp her a little bit towards the top here so I can stamp a a saying on the bottom so there's the little girl I'm just gonna clean my stamp really quick and then I'm gonna be using uh, for my pink stamper I'm going to be using, uh, this is the Levelicious set, and I just have a few of her stamp sets. I think I have four of them, and um, I've not really used them a whole lot. I, just, I guess I just haven't had the opportunity. I'm just starting to get into card making, so, so I'm going to use this I Heart You. And I'm just going to stamp it in black. I was originally going to stamp it in red, but I just decided to go ahead and stamp it in black. It's going right under the little girl. Okay, so there's my little girl, and I heart you. I'm going to glue this right on top. And that is going to be all that we're doing for layering so it's very simple just a couple mats a couple stamps and you're done but the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and add some color to our little girl All right so there you have it there is a very simple and basic Valentine's Day card so I hope you guys have enjoyed our Valentine's Day card series and I will see you later Thanks for stopping by the blog, guys.